it is time to show off one of my absolute favorite features in the entire system. So this is going to be the automated remediation section. And because Synchro is a fully embedded PSA and RMM, it allows this module to be extremely powerful. It's going to connect the two. And I call this in like an automagic way. Um, <laughs> so it, it, um, it also happens to be one of those modules in the system that enables to you to make money in your sleep. So in this section, you are able to create automated actions based on specific conditions. Uh, there's tons of different options here. So I'm just going to show you a very simple example. So here you have a full list of different types of uh, conditions here. So I'm going to set the trigger category just to say, hey, this device has low hard drive space. And you know what? There's no reason for you to spend any time and effort here if we can solve it quickly without you lifting a finger, truly. So I'm going to have this set to say, hey, let's run this script. Let's clean the temp files and let's clear the alert. We could be done with this. Um, nobody ever even has to know the customer, like the technician's not getting notified, the customer is just cleaning it up, no one's lifting a finger. Now, from here, you could have this script fire another automated remediation if the problem still exists after this script runs. In that case, you might want further actions to occur, right? So in that case, maybe I want it to create a ticket and I could have this auto assigned to a specific technician. I can set the priority. You can pre-fill all of these ticket fields. And maybe we want to take it a step further. We want to email the technician. We want to create some private notes and public notes. You can do all types of things in here um, in, the, uh, in the ticket section. So maybe even come in here and say, hey, let's post to our internal uh, teams in Slack and, and let us know. And you can do this for anything. I'm not just specific talking to uh, this low hard drive space monitor, but a couple other things that I want to mention in conditions, there are things like if I want to say, hey, if XYZ happens five times in a day, I could set a rate limit. Um, I can also have these different conditions be inside or outside of business hours. One example, um, I have a customer who told me, hey, I have it set up to in the evening. It goes to like my on-call technician. So I could say if this happens outside of business hours, then in that case, I want it to convert into a ticket and assign it to that specific on-call technician.